Well, I wish we knew really clearly. I mean, they're they're going through a really tough time. They're going through a very hard thing, and we're going to we're advising them to certainly apply for unemployment. We're advising them that we're going to try to work with the state, continue to work with the state to to make sure that all everybody you know ends up uh, on their feet at the end of the day and that, that things are okay. But um, but we have uh, a lot of questions as well. And I'm sure you've dealt with furloughs before, but is this kind of foreign territory this time around? Oh, this everything is new and different this time. I mean, they they um, they are trying to figure out the facts, uh, figuring out who has money, wh who really should be laid off. We're trying to figure out the same things. We think that they are laying people off unnecessarily, um, and we know it's difficult for everybody. I mean, including the people on their side, but. but uh, but we're, we're very upset at some of the layoffs that we're seeing. What's the best piece of advice you can give to them, whether it's filing for employment, or what, what's the first thing that they should be doing right now? Well, they should definitely be filing, filing for unemployment immediately. That's, that's, uh, that's job number one. Uh, two is getting sh making sure that they keep informed. Uh, you know, we'll, we'll keep information coming as, as best we can. Uh, we're going to try to press to make sure that people, uh, you know, that, that the state uh, does the right thing in the end. And that we this announcement by the governor, the civil emergency, it's kind of got people questioning what does it mean? Are you st are you in that category? What does it mean? Or do you understand what it means for them? Or I don't know what he's trying to do with that. I know that there are a number of things that we've tried to look at uh, on both sides that, um, that we thought would make sense. Uh, there may be things that he could do that would be constructive with, uh, with these new powers. Um, transferring people into vacant lines and so on. We haven't seen him do that. Uh, we think that he probably could have done everything he could have he's, he's, he can do with the emergency powers uh, by just working constructively with uh, other agencies and parts of it. Final question, I mean, do you see this ending anytime soon? I mean, people are surprised it's dragged out this long already. Do you worry, you know, how long these people are going to be out of work? Right. Um, I do worry, and the last time it, uh, that the federal government shut down, the total was something like 28 days. Um, we understand that there's a deadline in terms of the debt limit of the 17th, which is next week. Uh, there was some motion today, but this could drag on quite some time. This is a really important battle. Um, we can't just can't have democracy overridden by people who are ready to shut down government to, to get their way. Absolutely. Great. That's perfect.